Wealth. Money is very important to the president in spite of the fact that he makes a big deal of the fact that he and others, his son-in-law, for instance, do not take salaries. My guess is that the salary is small potatoes compared to the significant income generated for his brand by his actions. An example of this is his perennial use of his own properties for government events. I'm sure each of these properties charge top dollar to the government for their use and the president's bottom line is benefited. There seems to be a smoke and mirrors quality to all the talk about money. Maybe that is why he is so reticent to disclose his tax returns. He may, and probably doesn't, have near as much as he claims. This goes back to his narrative. In his mind, he is one of, if not the, wealthiest people in the world. This, regardless of the facts presented by others. Those who present these facts are just not aware of the vast amount of wealth which he has, nor will they ever know exactly what he has. He thinks he is wealthy, and, therefore, he is. The illusionary aspect of this comes into play when you realize that he is a master at using other people's resources to make himself look good. At present, he is using the full resources of the United States government he has hundreds of thousands of people at his beck and call. He can do anything he wants, and no one can hold him accountable since the president is immune to questioning. This plays into his narrative and is, enhances his own perspective of himself. Therefore, in his opinion, whatever bottom line his detractors discover is not reality. Since what he has is his, and what you have is his, there is no end to what he has available to him. What's more, once it has served his purpose to get him where he wants to be, he puts it aside and moves on to the next shill he needs for his self-aggrandizement. Currently, his shill is the conservative right from flyover America. He found a message that resonated with them, and the more he repeated it, the more they gravitated to him. But he does not believe what he is spouting. He is just using them to further his own persona. Other than enhancing himself, he really does not have an agenda. Once this particular group has served its purpose, then he will put them aside and begin looking for the next foil. And on and on it will go until someone finally is tired of the bait and switch.